Hey there future automators welcome to Gomes Tech Talks channel I'm Dr Gomiti and today we are diving into the 10 power automate interview questions that every fresher should know how to tackle Whether you are preparing for an interview or just to want to solidify your power automate knowledge you are in the right place We'll cover each question, break down the answers, talk about what interviewers are looking for and discuss the skills you need to ace these questions. Before we get started, I would like to tell you that I'll be showing you the 10 questions I will discuss and then these questions along with the answers and all the informations this document you can view it uh, through the link which I'm posting it in the description. <clears throat> so question number 1 what is power automate this is a fundamental question and your response sets the tone for the interview power automate also known as microsoft power, power automate is a cloud based service by microsoft that allows user to automate workflows and processes across various application without the need for the code so interviewers are looking for a concise definition here showcase your clarity of understanding and make sure to mention the no coding aspect that makes power automate accessible to a wider range of users if you want to dive deeper into all these topics you can go and check the official microsoft power automate documentation here where you can find right from the basics towards the advanced <clears throat> here is question number 2 What are the key features of Power Automate? This is your chance to show how well you understand the capabilities of Power Automate. Power Automate boasts several power features including <coughs> automating repetitive tasks, integrating the various apps and services, setting up approval workflows, sending notification alerts and extracting valuable data. interviewers want to know if you recognize the various functionalities of power automate emphasize how these features address business needs and boost efficiency now moving on to the question number 3 how do you create a workflow in power automate get ready to showcase your hands on skills okay So what you can answer is what creating a workflow in Power Automate involves using its visual designer. You start by selecting a trigger, adding actions and configuring conditions as needed. So interviewers are expecting you to talk them through and talk and walk them through the workflow creation process step by step. Confidence in your explanation demonstrates your practical familiarity with the tool. Here comes the question number 4 what is trigger in power automate triggers are central to workflow initiation okay so you can answer like a trigger is an event that prompts the execution of a workflow in power automate it could be something like a new email writing a file being added to a folder or a data changing in an application So show your understanding by clearly defining triggers and giving examples. Interviews interviewers want to see that you know how workflow starts in Power Automate. So here is a question to showcase your integration knowledge. Can you explain how connectors work in Power Automate? Connectors are integration bridges. <clears throat> that allow power automate to interact with external services and applications they come with predefined actions and triggers tailored to specific apps so showcase your grasp of integration concepts interviewers aim to gauge your understanding of how power automate communicates with external systems so moving on to the crucial aspect question number 6 how can you handle errors and exceptions in power automate So in Power Automate you can manage errors using features like scope and apply to each additionally you have terminate and run after condition to navigate unexpected scenarios demonstrate your problem solving prowess interviewers want to see your ability to troubleshoot and maintain smooth workflows 
question number 7 brings up to the approval workflow so how does an approval workflow work in power automate approval workflow enable users to send item or documents for approval to one or more individuals approvers can review make decision and provide feedback explain the concept of approval workflow clearly interviewers are looking for your comprehension of this collaborative process here is a practical question question number eight can you integrate power automate <coughs> with microsoft excel if so how absolutely power automate seamlessly integrates with excel you can automate tasks like updating excel files extracting data from sheets and even creating a new files showcase your knowledge of integrating with excel interviewers want to know how familiar with combining power automate with everyday ta task and tools so it's time for crucial question question number nine what are the licensing options for power automate this shows your understanding of services pricing structure so power automate offers various licensing plan including free per user and per flow option these plans determine the feature of you can access and your level of services so display your knowledge of licensing interviewers are assessing your awareness of the different plans available so the last but not least question 10 deals with troubleshooting how would you troubleshoot a failed workflow in a power automate so to answer this question you can start with to troubleshoot you would review the run history examine error messages check inputs and conditions and test individual components detail your troubleshooting approach interviewers are interested in your problem solving methodology so you can even know about the plans pricings and everything in this documentation if you are unable to find it here you can definitely go ahead here and check for power automate licensing okay i'll also leave this link in the comment section so that it will be easy for you to help or uh, read okay so just go through this <coughs> fine so you can see the complete information here fine and that wraps up our breakdown of the 10 power automate interview questions remember nailing these questions is about a combination of understanding practical knowledge and clear communication if you find this video helpful don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more career oriented content so i'll be posting you can view this document okay i will be um posting this link in the description so you can click that and view the document thanks for tuning in and i'll catch you in the next video stay curious and keep mastering your skills bye bye